Mapping Earth's Natural Features. Go ahead and enter your name here. And here is where you will find your video directions that you're watching right now. These are the objectives that you will be learning. And you will need to fill out this KWL chart, what you know, want to know, and what you've learned. Anytime you see this audio icon, go ahead and click it. And you will be able to press play. Earth's landform. And listen to what the words are if you are struggling with reading them. When you see a video, make sure you read the question beforehand and then watch the video by clicking play. Make sure you, wherever you see enter text, you enter the text to answer the question. In the red, there are sentence frames that you can use to be able to answer the question. You can see those sentence frames on every page that you need to answer a question. Here, you will need to look at the two pictures and answer the questions. And don't forget, you get to get a brain break. So if you need to slow down or recharge your brain, don't forget to tell your teacher what you did. So if you did your breathing, go ahead and put the circle around the breathing. Or if you went outside and you did some exercise, that's where that would go. Anytime there are teacher notes, you're simply reading those pages and moving on. You can add your own notes by clicking comment and adding your comment here. On this page, you will be writing a vocabulary word, the definition, example, sentence, and inserting an image. You can insert an image by clicking insert, image, and search the web. There will also be an image of a computer. Please click that to be able to watch a more in-depth video on how to insert an image. Here you will be sorting the image based on what the picture shows. Here you have a reading comprehension where you read and answer your text. And you have another video with a link to answer questions. On this page, you will be placing an X so that you click and drag the X where you think an earthquake will happen. There are multiple, so if you think there will be three earthquakes in a certain spot, you can move three X's. On your final project, you will be summarizing your lear learning and you have tutorials to help you.